Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Eric and thank you for tuning into my first ever YouTube video. Today I will be doing a quick unboxing video of the new Tamron 17 to 28 lens for the Sony full frame. Uh, this will only be a straightforward unboxing video just to see what is inside of the box. Hopefully this will help with those who are patiently waiting for their pre-orders to arrive. Um, but if you guys want a full review or comparison video, feel free to comment below and I will do my best to give you guys one. So let's go ahead and unbox this lens. When you first open up the box, you will find the precaution card and the manual. The manual of course comes in multiple different languages as well as the precaution card. Also included is a Tamron warranty card. If you register this product online, you get 6 years of warranty in the USA or 10 years in Canada. And finally, the lens itself. The body is made from high quality plastic and finished in matte black. The focus and zoom ring are made out of rubber, while the lens is moisture and dust resistant. And of course, it has two Tamron branded caps for both ends of the glass. The lens takes any 67mm filter and includes a plastic low profile lens hood. As you can see, this Tamron is very small and lightweight. It's very similar in size to the Sony 28-70 to kit lens, even without the hood. Both weigh about the same. Now attaching the lens to the body is a bit more difficult, and I believe that might be due to the weather resistant rubber ring. You just have to apply a little bit more pressure than other lenses, but I'm sure with time, it will loosen up and attach a lot easier. The lens is extremely lightweight, even when it's on a camera body. This will be perfect for any gimbal and will make the perfect travel lens. And with that being said, that concludes this unboxing video. If you liked this video, comment below what you liked and didn't like. Any feedback is appreciated and let me know what your thoughts are on the Tamron 17-28. to Thanks again for tuning in.